What's up guys, this is CJ from CJ's Keto Kitchen. Today I wanna make a really quick and simple, keto-friendly, low-carb waffle recipe. Let's get this done. So this is a very simple waffle uh, recipe. It's keto-friendly. Also low carb friendly if you're just doing low carb and not keto. Uh, the ingredients are very basic. Most people doing uh, keto or low carb will have these ingredients around the house. And so you'll need two eggs. You'll need two ounces of uh, softened cream cheese. If you want a sweeter waffle, uh, you can add some cinnamon and then you can also add um, a little bit of vanilla extract. Uh, I would also say that this recipe is pretty versatile. So if you wanted to experiment with this, with the basic ingredients, you could also add, um, you know, chopped up pecans with this. Uh, if you want to make this a more, I guess, a savory kind of waffle, you could add different seasonings and spices to it. And so there's just a lot of options you can go with with this recipe, but it's fairly simple. So your cream cheese, I would suggest that you go ahead and soften it. Soften for about 30 seconds or less. Yeah, it's softened. Um, so essentially all you're going to do is you're going to take your you're going to take your cream cheese dump it into a food processor. I guess you could do this by hand or you could do this in a bowl. You're going to crack your two eggs and add them to uh, your food processor. Add about a half a teaspoon of vanilla extract and this is optional. Okay, I'm just eyeballing that. And then you're gonna add uh, I want some sweetness with this, so I'm going to add a half a teaspoon of cinnamon. Cinnamon does have a few carbs, I mean, but it's so minor and, um, you know, it's, I, I don't even know. Uh, carbs are carbs, and sure, you don't want to waste your carbs, but cinnamon might, you know, some people really get hung up on the, the minor amount of carbs that are in cinnamon and, and to be honest, I don't. But anyway, you do keto the way you need to do it. You manage your own uh, keto diet the way you wanna do it. But I added a half a teaspoon to my waffle. So we're gonna mix that in our food processor. Let that rest for just a minute and kind of let the uh, mixture kind of settle down. Another way to speed that up is to take a spatula and just kind of, you know, push your mixture down into your container if you want to get every ounce. Uh, my waffle maker is preheating, so I just need to let, let that get warm. And this waffle is only going to take five minutes to make. So it probably only took uh, maybe two minutes to prepare. And then, like I said, it's going to cook for five minutes. It's a, probably a little slower right now in my head just because I'm trying to film this while I'm trying to make the waffle. But it's, this is an easy, quick process. So my waffle maker is ready. I've got the green light, literally. I really do have the green light to get going. I'm gonna carefully open this up. And yeah, you can see that the steam is coming out. Uh, I am going to spray this with some coconut oil to prevent sticking. And then I'm gonna take my mixture, just take it, and I'm gonna pour it into 
my uh, to my waffle maker. Now you've got to know your waffle maker, and everybody's waffle makers are different. Uh, I may have just poured a little bit too much in the last time I did this. However, uh, I didn't get any spillage, so I'm gonna go just like I did the last time. I uh, got my mixture in there. I'm gonna close the lid, and in five minutes we'll come back and see what our waffle looks like. Okay, so my waffle. Um, so my waffles are ready they look really good it's been five minutes actually I'm a little bit over five minutes now these waffles are not gonna be crispy so if you like a crispy waffle what like I do you're gonna have to take one additional step and that's to toast these waffles I'm going to yeah see these are definitely ready to go they look really good they're both ready. Really firm. So there was no, absolutely no flour in this recipe. This is just cream cheese. I'm transferring these over to my toaster. This is just, uh oh. So you gotta handle these kind of gently because they aren't really all that um, solid. I mean, as far as, I mean, they're hearty and they're solid. Um, but when you're handling them, they're not like um, like bread because there's no flour or any of any type, not even almond flour, coconut flour, none of the, even the low carb safe flours. Um, this is truly just eggs and cream cheese. I'm gonna toast this for just a moment and to crisp this up and then I'll show you what it looks like when we get it on our plate. So our waffles just came up out of the toaster. They crisp, crisped up a bit, made them a little bit harder. But again, these are pretty, um, they're pretty delicate because they're, again, there's no flour in it. So there you have it. Those are keto friendly, low carb waffles that are very easy to make. If you're new to our channel, uh, we upload new content every uh, Sunday, new recipes. Uh, we do a segment called Keto Conversations every Wednesday, and we do occasionally load uh, new videos uh, throughout the week. So be sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and we appreciate you watching CJ's Keto Kitchen. Peace.